Sì. Che c'è? We're in Rome. We're in Rome. The cities of ages. The city of ages. Ages. What is it? Many years. The yes. city that lives with this with this, with this uh, classical period. In EU. <laughs> Campo Marzio. Importante Campo Marzio. Buono uh, picco. Oh. Over here. Wait, let's go. Buono Let's stay away from this. We got out of my draw. We zijn nu op de Spaanse Daar zit je het. Wow, wow, wow. Oh la la. Very beautiful. I'm go now going to do it in French. Bonjour. You can see. <laughs> you can see the Spanish tropeer in there. It's, uh, it's very famous. We are in the center of the world. My father thinks it's not true, but he thinks. And I would like to give you some um, rounds around it. So we're going to go upstairs and then you follow me and then... Okay, come. Pico. La la. Where are you now? Voila, uh, I'm standing now on the on the traps. Uh, it's uh, very nice. Um, I can uh, you can see the other people moving like little little insects, like so, woo, to each other. It's uh, very nice. You can see, now my father is going to turn the camera so you can see part of the Spanish trap and <laughs> stairs. Fontana, eh? Now you can see here one of the most famous things about the the, French, the Spanish stairs are that you can see it over there. It's the fon it's fontaine. 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 Fontaine from Fontaine. And uh, my father is going now going to show you a little part of it. So let's move the camera and we can all see it. Bye bye. Si, si, si. Uno, due, tre. Now we're talking about the fontaine, and that's over there. And I'm going to, and I'm going to give you some information about it. It was uh, born in the late century of the 90s. It was created by somebody very not un, not known. It was um, quite an impressive prestation because it was. Not the thing they were used to be like fountains, you know. Very, very, very extraordinary. You can see over there, and there are some tomtoons, you know, some things they stick out the water. And um, I don't know really what it, what it should be meant, but that's the inspiration of the artist. He thinks you can see anything you want in it. So. Just have a close look and maybe you can fantasize what you want about. Okay, I'll see you next time. Bye bye. <laughs> we go to the pet. Now we're going to the Pantheon. Follow me. <laughs> go. Now we're standing here in the richest street of all Italy, if you don't include Milan. The Ray-Ban.
I'm ready. What you can see here? Okay, is there. In front of me, please. Uno. So, if you can see there, there's the parliament. The official, official parliament, you know. It's really, really big. It's not quite as beautiful as I thought. Now we had the parliament. We see another thing here on this plaza. You can see here the col. I can I cannot speak it in, but I will say it in Italian. The Colada di Trianus. It's the most. It's very famous. About its huge size, and about that it has a really big history because you can see what happened in his uh, year when he was uh, king. He was not really king, but I don't know, don't know the emperor. When he was emperor, um, in top of the top of the uh, Pilato, you can see there's somebody like a saint. But before, when there was, uh, they removed it, and there was uh, somebody. He, no, his uh, stand. Hello, we are here at the Piazza di Pietra. What means? The, uh, okay, three. Hello, we are here today on the Steenplein. Dat is om dit plein heet het Steenplein, omdat je hier kan zien. En wat is het nou, jongens, meisjes en jongens? Dit is het Panteo. Goed zo, Martin. Nou, wat dus heel grappig is, is dat dit het Steenplein is. En er staat hier een heel groot stenen gebouw, snap je? Ja, nou, dat vond ik ook al zo grappig. Nou, als je even kijkt hier naar beneden, dan zie je hoe, hoe het vroeger de Rome was. Je ziet hier dat het ongelooflijk diep is. Nee, dat wil je niet van. Nee, 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 dat wil je niet. Nee joh, ik wil niet. Dus wat betekent dus dat het nog hoger was dan het nu al is? Nou, dat is toch incredible? Nou, dat zeg ik ook. Anyway, we're, this is the back side of the building. So we're going to do the front side. So walk with me and I'll guide you around. Thank you. Okay, no. One of the most famous things about it is that it's built for all the gods that there were in the Roman Empire uh, time. Um, because they were afraid that if they forgot one god, they don't get the, the, the good uh, fortune they, they wanted. So, basically, it's just for every god you could ever imagine. Nowadays, when the Christian uh, Christian came up, it be it became a church, and now it's just a mon monument of one of the greatest things in Rome. I would please take you to inside, but you just we can't film there, so you just have to wait for like 30 minutes, and then we come back to you. Okay, thank you for traveling with Chris Airlines. Bye bye. <laughs>